I went to visit my mommy in Bergamo and we buy this chicken. So we buy about eight chicken that day and this was one of them. And we got we brought some to our house. And then we were killing this chicken. Oh god, I, I used the word key. Okay, so when we are processing this chicken, one of our, another big mommy said, we are supposed to pray for the chicken before we buy the chicken. So I was like, mama, why are we going to pray for the chicken? He said, no, you have to pray for the chicken. You have to tell the chicken, but you're so rest in peace. And I was like, ah, ah, mama, this, this chicken does not have a soul. He said, no, all the chicken have a soul. They have soul. The, we, we have to pray that they are so rest in peace and i said me i don't understand though he said since so far there is blood in their body since so far there is blood and they have bones they have life and then now that we have buyed we have processed it we have we have, have processed we have removed all the feathers we have removed all the intestine now they've gone to meet with their maker so we have to pray for them to rest in peace and i'm like i'm confused and i was like why growing up the process of buying or processing chicken is just letting the blood go down you know after the the ark of noah we have to let their blood go down that was the commandment right i don't understand we have to pray for them to rest in peace so you guys let me know in the comment section so i made you for my friend who was coming with her pregnant no for my sister who was coming with her pregnant friend and when the lady ate the food was like the when she entered my kitchen she was like oh boy it's like what uh, this too is is, is is the aroma is uh smelly like as if for a christmas that is it's like christmas too immediately you know pregnant women with their nose immediately she said i beg now now live chicken i was like yes it's a live chicken she said hey no wonder because even even as she, as she entered the kitchen she was like everywhere was was filled of christmas like nigerian christmas day i was just laughing and then when she ate the food she confirmed i said we needed to pray for the chicken i said as you are eating just begin to say may the life may the soul of the chicken rest in peace <laughs> and it was really funny so let me know in the comments section if processing chicken we have to pray for the chicken for their soul to rest in peace or for them to die well so i don't know if that's truly true but since all my days all my 30 something years of living in this world i've never prayed that the soul of an animal chicken or goat to rest in peace because after buying them you buy them no need to be doing special prayer for them so far their blood go down to me they have they've done their job the next thing to chop them so let me know in the comment section below if truly they are really going to heaven all these animals are going to heaven because she did a lot of stories uh, story time with us and then i was like okay if if it's so thank you for watching see you guys in my next video please try and share my video bye bye